Well, it's Greth and welcome to a very important game in Era vs. Lucky Fool. First, let's see what the replays. I'm supposed to go golfing in a moment? Cool. Anyway, this is game six. It is now 3 to 2 for Arrow. And this is a best of seven game, so this could very well be the last game. If Lucky Fool does not win, then it would be 3 3, and we'd go to the final match. So, very exciting here. Um, right, so what happens? Lucky Fool. I think if he would have gone in with those vultures in the last game and raped that expansion, he would have been able to get back into it. Because it was three base to two, but Lucky had he had a, that one attack where he was toe to toe with Arrow. The problem was he didn't have that third base to keep macroing up. So, yeah, I don't know. Maybe the game was already lost then. But I think with that vulture as he would have run through there and killed all those probes and mined it up it might have made a difference um, and then just that last push that he did well the the flank was bad positioning the mines weren't there yet they held back arrow held back his zealots and then ran him in a few got in and then was that that was that and it was very vulture heavy so after those zealots were gone um, it was pretty much over so let's see what's going to happen here yet again we're seeing similar build orders don't know why Lucky abandoned that 2 fact because it was well he's lost 3 great games in a row now because he expanded and he pushed too hard in the beginning because that's where Arrow or also had all of his goons still left and Lucky Fool lost all of his marines in there as well. So I'm going to just go going up. Oh, let's see. Rooting for Lucky on this one. Maybe because I know the count of the replays. Who knows? <laughs> There we go, so because done. We have a scout in for arrow and also one for Lucky. Again, nibbling away at the pylon, trying to take it down. Now, been a good series, some nice games, some frustrating plays. All in a day's work. I'm doing this in one go. Probably won't post them in one go, because, hey, now I've got a buffer of about six or seven games. Pew pew pew. Gonna go away. Factory going down. Speed being researched for zealots. And another pylon going down. Not a sneaky one this time. So it's probably gonna try and play straight up. And we do have the second factory, so he is going to go for the two fact again. And let's see how Arrow responds. The reason Arrow lost to the two fact in the earlier games was because he expanded afterwards and didn't go for a third gateway or just a two gate push. So let's see how it happens here. He's going to go for Robo Bay first. Robo facility. Second factory is done, first tank's gonna be out, and there's gonna be a little bit of a push, and I think he might be able to spot this fact. The fact he has a fact. Go, okay, SCV's gonna go in, gonna see second gateway. So I think this might be a problem for Lucky. Okay, nice little contain that he can't get in. Nice little block. It's not really a contain if it's inside your own base. Gonna try and push out. There's only two guns here. Also, only four marines, which will probably tip Arrow off to the fact there's a two fact. Machine shop's done. And here come the tanks. 
No upgrades whatsoever yet. More goons incoming. Oh, more goons, more goons, more goons. And the observatory. Here comes a confrontation, two tanks. More marines as well, and he's not gonna chase him. That's what lost him those marines the last time. Not gonna chase, just gonna build up. But I'll give Arrow the chance to regroup as well. Keep pushing goons. Little, yep, gonna bunch them up there. Five, six, seven on the way. And here comes the push, SEVs and everything. Tanks and vultures incoming. We've got siege tech being researched. Vultures in there with no upgrades. The observer sees it. Arrow setting up for a flank and bringing his probes to block it. That was a rather stupid move by Arrow, losing those probes for no reason. But now the flank goes in from the front here as well, from the back. Gonna nicely flank the probe, actually doing damage now. Gonna get flanked from all sides, and that's really bad for Lucky. It's focusing down. Gonna go straight into the base, he's doing well. Gonna block it off now, he's got a lot of guns reinforcing, gonna lose all of his marines, only three tanks left. He's now gonna siege, this is gonna be the mistake. The guns are gonna move in, he's gonna in siege now and this is gonna get him up top. Gonna lose enough guns, but that's sieging. There you go, only